Doctors told me I was having congestive heart failure. A few years ago, Gerald Schroeder had symptoms of congestive heart failure after a heart attack and stent placement to open blocked arteries. Felt really nauseated. He's better now and is participating in a Mayo Clinic study to learn more about fluid buildup on the lungs. A buildup of fluid on the lung or around the lung is a, a main consequence of heart failure. Dr. Brian Taylor says it's also a problem for many people exposed to high altitudes, such as climbers. We think there's a lot of parallels. Dr. Bruce Johnson heads the expedition on Mount Everest, where they're monitoring climbers to learn more about fluid buildup on the lungs, or pulmonary edema. Before they left, the team conducted studies in the lab with heart patients like Gerald. So one of the goals of this study is to, to look at some of the mechanisms involved in lung fluid regulation. They want to find out what's happening in the lung when it retains or rids itself of fluid. Their main tool is a CT scanner. They inject study participants with a contrast agent. The CT then allows them to see where blood and fluid are as they move through the lungs and heart. Once they learn more about the nature of the fluid buildup, they hope to find medications to effectively prevent or treat it. If those drugs help clear the fluid and then help overall physiology, then it makes sense to us that we can transcend that into high altitude studies and perhaps use those same therapies to individuals who are susceptible to getting this buildup of fluid on the lung at high altitude. For Mayo Clinic News Network, I'm Vivian Williams.